darlings! Welcome to my channel! I'm your favorite Turtle Sita here today again with a new pickup pile reading. And this topic, my darling, you already know about romantic fantasies that your future spouse will be having after first time they meet you. The super first time physically they met you. And then after that, what are gonna be thinking about you? And it's more about the fantasies and something, you know, what fantasies they're gonna be having after the met you and my darlings if you're new to my channel have no idea what is going on let me tell you my darlings i am an intuitive trader i use my intuition and magical power to channel the message from angels and universe to guide you guys this is purely intuitive best reading my darling trust your intuition and gut feelings in order to choose the perfect group for yourself remember this is a general reading so 80 to 90 percent of these messages are for some of you 100 person is going to resonate with you and is going to make you feel like you're having a personal reading okay and if something is not resonating let that fly away maybe that message was not for you so i present you this beautiful three piles as three shell okay so this is group number one this is group number two and this is group number three okay my darlings let me give you a beautiful closer look before that make sure you know you are positive you drank a lot of water and you are not in a crowded place because sometimes you know in a crowded place sometimes you pick up other people's energies so make sure you are in a secluded place while choosing the pile if you never, and if you're drawn to more than one pile feel free to choose this pile my darling maybe you got some mixing messages that wanted to come to you okay my darling it's time for a closure look. I hope my darling you choose the perfect group for yourself. I'll give the timestamps in the description box. Go there. Click on the timestamps. The video will give you the exact timing when your pile is going to be started. Okay, my darling. And if you're not in my subscriber, go ahead, subscribe to my channel and also hit that bell icon so that you can notified by YouTube whenever I upload new video and I upload every day, my darling. Like every freaking day. I love to get in touch with your energy. Okay, my darling. So let's go jump into your reading. Hello, my darlings. If you choose this amazing group number one, this beautiful shell, this is your reading, my darling. So first of all, we are going to be knowing that, you know, approximate the time or the places that you're going to be meeting your person for the first time physically. Okay, so when we're, you're going to be meeting your future spouse physically for the first time. So we're going to be pulling three cards to know that. And then we're going to be knowing from the other tarot cards that what exactly their romantic, oh no, romantic fantasies will be about you. Okay, my darling. So when, where are the places that you're going to be meeting your future spouse for the first time physically? Because I love to know that. You know, every time I do this kind of tarot, I really love to know that because it's so exciting, right? So my darling, so let's go check what the cards are telling you. So you got the Hermit. Uh, you got the sun, wow, the sun and the hermit, and you got the knight of sword. First of all, my darlings, that place, that will be full of competitiveness, okay? <laughs> wow, and the sunny day. So, I can sense, my darling, that, you know, how you're going to be meeting exactly the time you're going to be meeting your super single, you're not in a relationship, and your person is also a single person, they are not in a relationship, they are bachelor, you are bachelor, Two bachelors are coming. Knight of Sword is very fast moving energy. Also, Knight of Sword is giving me some kind of competitiveness. Maybe where there is like lots of competitors. You can see lots of competitors are there. Maybe business meeting. Maybe where uh, a place where people are really trying to get attention of your person. Or your person may be a celebrity. Or they are someone. Or business head or CEO. They are very bossy type. I don't know, maybe they are in a place that they are in a, such a high position that everyone wants attention. It may be uh, like different for different people, okay? Maybe they are a celebrity, maybe they are business head, maybe they are professor, maybe he's, he or she is your boss. 
someone okay my group number one you person really uh they are very mature they are definitely older than you physically mentally spiritually they're going to be older than you wiser than you and there are lots of people that they really want attention from your person and you know they're approaching them something like that i i'm sensing some business proposals going on with the sun card you are the youngest energy in that room or you are the most charming personality in this in that room okay so i can't say that to you person really look at you like you are the little sun you are the little light okay so your person really going to give you lots of attention in the first meeting and other people will be a bit jealous that why you are getting lots of attention my darlings cards are telling me okay because look at that the sun card that is representing your energy you're gonna be very positive vibrant and such a bright energy you're very charming at that day you're gonna be feeling overly confident and somewhere like somewhat i don't know like you feel like you are a sun, okay? Like you got light, you got positivity, you got that warmth in yourself. And then the hermit, that is your person, okay? The first time you're gonna be looking and you look at that, there there is a lantern in the in the hermit's hand. So I can sense that you are like the sun and your person really look at you like, oh my god, that little that the little sun, such a curiosity, positive energy. And other people are fighting to get their attention, okay? So your person is going to give you lots of attention. I hope you get my point. Uh, this is a crowded place. Not superly crowded. But mediocre. Okay. That is going to a medium crowded place. Um, there is like some, some kind of concert. Or you can say um, a meeting is going on. It's maybe a business meeting. It's maybe a workshop that is really going on. And your person is the speaker. Or they are the main man or main woman and in, in that room and other people are really approaching lots of things and you are one of them but your person is really attracted towards you because of your beauty first of all i can see physical beauty second you're very much bright like a sun and you're completely different uh from other people okay so i really need some confirmation because it's very unique okay um hmm <laughs> Other people might say that you guys already know each other, but it's not true. You guys are meeting for the first time, but the way your person, the, the way this person look at you and talk to you, the first time you guys talking with each other, other people are listening and other people can see, other people can sense that both of you have already met each other somewhere else. Nobody is going to believe that this is your first meeting. I hope you I hope you get my point, my darling, okay? It's maybe different for different people, but exactly if you choose this video and this specific group number one, this is the message for you, my darling, that you meant to be, uh, you meant to know that, okay? <laughs> oh my God, the first meeting will be amazing. Other people will be so jealous that you are getting lots of attention, but they need attention, okay? So what's more about that first meeting, first physical meeting? Uh, page of Cups with the Seven of Wands, self-defense, self-protection. Uh, with the Page of Cups, this person that you're going to be meeting, they're going to be overly protective of themselves. They don't open up to anyone easily. With the Page of Cups, uh, this person, you know, their relationship is really going to be starting like a childhood crush or... Like childlike curiosity because Page of Cups, you know, Page of Cups is a very young and fresh energy. And pages are all about, lots of curious about the love relationship, okay? <laughs> lots of curious about this caring nature. With the seven of, seven of Wands, that is lots of protection. I don't know why your person that you really feel, okay, your future is supposed to really feel very much protected and very much safe with you and vice versa. Uh, and your person really open up to you very easily, okay? Uh, look at that. Your person will be... Maybe they're very much mature in their work or whatever they are doing. They're very much mature in that. But in love matter, they're like the page. They're like the child. And they really don't know how to do that thing, okay? Um, maybe they're really putting up a boundary so that other people don't take their advantage. But you are someone that you came into their life and your person feels like... They need to uh, stop guarding themselves anymore. 
wow the first meeting will be amazing okay it's really uh makes me feel like those korean dramas where ceo fall in love with uh their subordinate or something like that i'm not telling that you are subordinate maybe they are subordinate okay <laughs> maybe this is like vice versa okay maybe you're someone that your person really needs your attention and you are giving them lots of attention okay so first meeting will be like oh my god quite magical okay it's very much unexpected you're not gonna be seeing this person as your hubby or wifey but let me tell you one thing my darling your person really got a strong crush on you yeah i know it's really difficult for you to believe that but it is what it is your person really got a strong 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 crush on you so my darlings next we are gonna be knowing that after seeing you for the first time or just having this connection with them your person's romantic fantasies are the way they really fantasize about you okay what is that thing okay um your person's fantasies we guides my guardian angel archangel michael my herself please tell me about group number one's future spouses fantasies yeah and two three okay we're gonna be knowing more okay the first thing is magician then you got the uh strength and the queen of pentacle first of all my darling um two major arcana and one code card your person is going to be very skillful with their imagination with their uh you know fantasy world wow your person is really fantasizing that they are taking care of you you are in charge you are really dominating them no matter who you are man woman watching this video your person really wants you to dominate them i know for some of you you're gonna be saying that no 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 no, no. i want them to dominate me in the bedroom or in where but in somewhere but let me tell you my darling this is a fantasy right your person really have fantasizing about you that they are massaging your feet you are on top of them you're really bossing them around you are telling them that hey massage me hey give me a beautiful massage or like um i have an i have a, a headache okay just do something and vanish my headache with the strength card you are really doing some angry love making or you are really forcing them to make love with them i don't know your person is so wild when they are in fantasies okay uh what they're fantasizing about you first of all you are really um having okay first fantasy is for one number one is that both of you are having argument and then oh my god you are forcing them to kiss them or you are forcing your future spouse to make love this is your person's fantasy okay i hope you get my point right your person really fantasizing about you forcing them to kiss you or to love them okay and then i'm getting that your person is your sub like submissive one okay you are the dominant they are the submissive and they are really taking care of your feet taking care of your body they're really giving you lots of uh care and nurture wow your person really really want to obey you in their fantasies wow uh, with the magician card i can sense that your person really loves you know <laughs> like stripping in front of you maybe they really want to be your stripper <laughs> they're gonna be stripping and show, showing you the figure you know how good they look something about their figure that they really want to show you my group number one this is one of their fantasies hmm. what else queen of pentacle okay so i'm getting that your future spouse really going to provide you lots of nurturing energy okay it's like material things money nurturing cuddling touching you giving you pleasure giving you back massage foot massage head massage um also with the strength card they really want your power over them okay like you are overpowering you are dominating them you are ruling them you are ruling their body mind and soul okay i don't know why your person i don't know maybe my group number one 
you guys are having lots of masculine energy around you okay you guys are very bossy okay you guys are very bossy very masculine maybe lots of male watching my video or maybe you're a female it's okay but you got lots of masculine energy okay you're very active you're very powerful okay what's more first of all your person really love the way you look your body is amazing queen of sword look at that also they fantasize that they are standing in front of you and showing that how much they love you i don't know you whenever you say no to them your person get crazy over you okay so my group number one your person really fantasizing about you that they want to kiss you but you are telling them no not right now and that's making them crazy okay like your person is begging you that please let me kiss you please 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 like yeah like they are begging you and you are the dominant one you are really controlling them okay it's their fantasies i don't know why do i feel like their fantasies are too much of um like begging and spanking and loving but in a way they are very soft okay wow your person is like a whole lot of fantasies your person really loves to do lots of fantasies because two queens are here queen of pentacle and queen of sword high priestess yeah definitely your person love your spiritual gift my group number one maybe you're a very spiritual person you're gonna be telling your person that i'm very spiritual i do this 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 stuff or i do these things and your person will be like yes teach me okay teach me be my king or queen okay rule over me rule over my body your person really um act like a kitty or a beautiful kitten in front of you oh my god why do i feel like look at that queen of sword queen of cups strength and the high priestess the female energy is the dominant one okay believe it or not my darling in this relationship whoever the female is or whoever having the feminine energy they're gonna be the dominant one okay wow so if you're a female watching this video you are the dominant one and if you are a female but having some masculine energy let me tell you your person will be the dominant one i hope you get my point right wow 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 my darling it's amazing uh, uh one of their fantasies is that you are just sitting there looking graceful looking like beautiful and gorgeous and your person is literally admiring your beauty okay also my darling your person really wants you to wear some uh seductive outfit as well i don't know maybe that really makes them go crazy whenever you wear some uh seductive outfit <laughs> your person really watching you that you are um making yourself beautiful making yourself comfortable in any kind of situation okay you are just applying cream on over your body you're just you know uh, combing your hair you're just dressing oh my god your person really love to look at you this is one of their fantasies that they are really looking at you when you are getting dressed up or when you are getting undressed yeah look at that look at that the hair of an and the four of pentacle your person really love to see you when you are sleeping okay or maybe when you are drunk okay i don't know my darling if you drink or not but if you are drunk or if you feel like i need to have some sleep and you are half undressed and your person really love to undress you. Maybe this is one of their fantasies that they are undressing you when you are really sleeping. Okay. You are sleeping. Your person really undressing you. And then removing your makeup. Removing all accessories. And putting you into the bed. And cuddling with you. Or having a back hug. Yeah, this is your person's fantasy that they really want to take care of you. Are taking care of energy with the hair of and they really want a beautiful committing relationship. Okay, your person is all about commitment. Commitment is completely, completely here in this relationship. Even in their fantasies, 
they're very much committed okay they don't look at other girl they don't look at other boys they only look for you with the hero friend queen of sword queen of sword is also very much icy queen and also very much you know loyal number five number four number two one and eleven is going to be strong for you also number 11 is twin from journey i don't know your person really want to make love with you in a uh, beach area desert area okay uh -huh. this is one of their fantasies uh, also my darling they really want to feed you some grapes some wine uh one of their fantasies is that you are their teacher okay i am getting that you are their teacher you are teaching them and plus you are seducing them by wearing some amazing outfit and then again you are teaching them like you are the teacher and they are your student and you are really dominating them wow wow it's so it's really fantasies okay like look at that with the high priestess you are literally teaching them something uh with the hero of card my darling yeah of course you are like maybe one of their fantasies is you are their boss and you are overpowering them and you are really telling them that your mind body soul is mine so be mine don't go anywhere your person really fantasizes about these things that you are overpowering them you are really you know oh my god like physically you are forcing them to have love you know of course semantically not abuse man don't worry ah your person really 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 they want somebody uh, that oh my god your person really want the positive one your person really want a possessive partner or possessive person okay my darling this is one of their fantasies that my person will be very possessive very protective and just uh you know spying on me stalking me yeah this kind of energy then what's there okay what's more uh, i want to know what is your person's current energy okay whenever you're watching this video what your person is going through yeah three card is enough i uh, stand still okay my darling so i'm getting that right now your person is going through lots of lots of lots of shadow work okay your person is going through lots of shadow work they're really knowing their shadow self that what is their negative energy what is their bad habit what they need to get rid of what they need to let go so they are really knowing their dark self okay it's like soul searching energy that they are going through and it's really going to help them to get rid of all the negative energies from uh, his or her body and there is heart chakra awakening that I can also see. Card number 52, number 5 is about change. Number 2 is about soulmate. So maybe through traveling you're going to be meeting this person or maybe mental change is very much here. Okay, mental your person is changing. Wow, this is a beautiful card. The heart of the sky. Your person is really knowing themselves more in a better way. Okay, more, more, more better way. Maybe your person is someone that they know some kind of uh, spiritual power that they already have but right now they are really knowing that they are more powerful than ever the heart of the sky brings you a sacred reminder you are a channel for the original energy of creation become the paintbrush the canvas and the artist all guided by the heart of the sky Set your intention ethically and clearly and allow the universe to take care of details. The heart of the sky is love force that made all creation possible. This same force is present when you create with originality. When you bring formlessness to form or inspired ideas to expression. The primeval force doesn't know good or bad. It is up to us to provide the clear intention that will guide it to manifest. The heart of sky helps us call in beauty from the invisible world and birth it in the world of matter. Your person is really a master manifester, my group number one. Your person right now manifesting lots of beautiful things about themselves. Because you know what, my darling, when a person really knowing their shadow side, this person can able to know their light side, their talent and their powerful side also. 
because when this when they know there is dark maybe also there is light because without light there is no dark without dark there is no light all right my darling so your person right now is knowing their talent knowing that they are very much beautiful they are powerful they can do whatever it takes to do okay if your person really uh, becoming more self-aware uh, they have healed from the past from the toxic past maybe my darlings your person has gone through lots of toxicity in their life maybe toxic friendship toxic relationship but they have worked out that what they need and what they don't need so lots of clarity lots of choices your person already got in their life and they're choosing the right thing for themselves okay the upper world yes your person is really going for the upper world for the spiritual world because they are creating the channel to upload all the things or to oh, sorry to download all the things from the other dimension maybe your person is really connected to the other dimension like the god like the angels your person is not looking down on themselves and on others your person is uh, moving on from ego from a jealousy from any kind of negative things like addiction obsession or um envious energy or dark phases darkness or sadness or pessimism is really going away from your person uh my group number one your person is really becoming like a bird like a beautiful angel okay the upper world this is also connected to the god universe angel of attraction align with the universe okay your person is right now they are aligned with the universe. They are very spiritual. They are very positive. Because after all, my darling, they know what the dark side is. So that's why they know what they can do with their positive side. They are in a very good energy and they are really angelic. They are going to be looking beautiful. They are going to be very pretty and handsome, my darling. It's for sure. Because after all, they are like the angel. Okay? They are like the angel. Because heart of the sky and the upper world. Wow. They're like the angel, like they know what they need, they know what they don't need. Wow. It's amazing, isn't it? Okay, I'm going to be choosing one oracle card for this connection that you're going to be having with your person. What? Why? <laughs> the card is why. Your person got lots of curiosity about you. Lots of curiosity. Like your person really want to know you more, more, more and more. Maybe no one ever, okay, wanted to know you more. Maybe this person is really going to be <laughs> very enthusiastic to know you more in a better way. Because you are like the puzzle box that they want to solve, okay. And my darling, being in this relationship, you and your person, both of you are going to be knowing lots of things about the universe and about the world. About how really things work, okay. So being with you, your person really feels like... All the puzzles, all the problems have one solution and that's in you, okay? So whenever your person really look into your eyes, your person can see that you are not a normal person. You got the all answer, but you don't know your own power. Your person really think that you don't know that how special you are. Time for healing. Okay, so first time meeting this person after that fantasies and romantic ideas your person can think that you are the epitome of healer okay so you can heal my darling my group number one your person have that healing energy from you your person got that from you because you are very powerful you are healing them maybe you are really healing them from past baggages and your person is really forgetting all those past failures because of you. Because you changed them. Your commitment is being tested. Maybe your person really got trust issue. Okay, they don't trust anybody easily. So they got some trust issues. So that's why they really want to know you more before they can commit to you. And you will be able to know that. Maybe you're going to be telling them in return that, hey, I know you don't trust anybody. But I hope you can trust me, okay? So you can taste my commitment as well. And your person feels so relieved to know that. That you can understand them without even asking them anything in return. Okay. So let's pull one more card. Okay. So here you go. Two cards. Okay. So 
the vulture spirit nothing is wasted and the fox will think on your feet so i can sense my darling your person is going to be very clever very very witty okay their intelligent is on the another level okay their iq level is very strong also with the fox spirit think on your feet they're gonna be very intuitive person okay their intuition is always on the point with the vulture spirit your person really very much good in savings okay so when it comes to wasting their time wasting their money no they're not gonna be doing that maybe in the past they waste their time they waste their money and they waste their love and emotion to the fake people now they know what they want now they know what they need that's why my darling they are really giving you lots of lots of lots of affection lots of love and lots of things that you need okay so nothing is wasted at all so i'm gonna be reading from the book what really means the vulture spirit nothing is wasted card number 63 right okay 63 yeah vulture spirit look at that what seems hideous has its own beauty and the recycling and repurposing the vulture does is as important as any other activity in nature that supports the cycle of life vulture spirit's message is that nothing is to be wasted for nature sees value in everything that exists what seems rotten and ugly has the potential to be transmuted into something beneficial and you are reminded that any suffering you have experienced has not gone to waste wisdom and understanding that arouse from those experience are talismans that that will serve you on your journey wherever you go okay my darling so i don't know maybe you have been through lots of tough experience lots of tough uh, knowledge in life so you may thought that oh my god that was too much for me but let me tell you my darlings that was very much needed so that you can have a uh, blissful future with your person okay so what you're having more what you're having more trust yes my darling your person really trusts you a lot also lots of trust is coming from your side to them and from their side to you also my darling trust the process wherever angels are really taking you don't get impatient okay don't think too much or stop overthinking if you're thinking that when where how i'm gonna be meeting i don't know if we if i am gonna be meeting at all this person let me tell you my darlings trust the process okay whatever is going to happen that is going to happen helpful people is here okay helpful people maybe you're gonna be meeting this person in a crowded place or there will be helpful people that is really helping you to meet this person it's maybe your angel your spirit guides and sisters your mom dad your sibling or a friend that you know for a long time uh the situation will improve whatever your situation is right now while watching this video that will improve as well a year from now maybe a year from now you're gonna be meeting this person or if you are already in a relationship then a year from now there will be beautiful change or level up in your relationship and my darling if you are single a year from now your status will be changed you will be mingle okay <laughs> oh my god this is all i got for you my group number one i hope you like this video give it a thumbs up also my darling subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon so that you can notified by youtube whenever i upload new videos comment down below which part is resonating with you also my darling suggest many kind of topic i'll definitely do that till then stay blessed and happy i love you guys so much hello my darlings my group number two so if you choose this amazing show this is your reading so we are gonna be knowing my darlings that the place when where how you're gonna be meeting this person okay so we're gonna be knowing exactly you know like approximate time or that places that you probably meet your person physically for the first time okay my darling spirit guides my garden angel archangel michael Mahersal channel message to me for my beautiful book number two and we are gonna be knowing that where or how you're gonna be meeting your person physically for the first time okay okay okay, okay. whatever okay whatever spirits wants you to know if i need any more card i will definitely pull more card so what do you got let's see two of pentacles seven of sword and page of cups 
Ah, why do I feel like secret crush? Ooh, this person is having secret crush on you, definitely, okay? Uh, maybe secretly this person is watching you, okay? And you don't even know that. That person is really watching you secretly. Or secretly this person really going to love you or the way you look. Uh, page of Cups. This person is going to be younger than you or they look younger. I don't know some young energies here. Maybe you are more mature. Uh, physically, they're going to be young looking. Physically, they're going to be younger than you. Wow. With the two of pentacles, my darling, I'm already getting that. The place that you're going to be meeting that is uh, maybe near the water body area, near, you know, like open place. Okay. Look at that. In this two card, can you see that? This is like water going on. There is like water going on behind. So maybe a water body area is here, like ocean pool or artificial swimming pool somewhere, okay? And let me tell you one more thing, that you are really doing great in your career, okay? And you're really having your own time. You're busy with something, okay? <laughs> wow. Mm. Seven of Swords and Two of Pentacles. Uh, seven months from now, two years from now, you're going to be meeting this person. And for other of you, two months is here. Oh, it's very unexpected when you are doing great in your career, when you are doing great in your study. And you're very much busy with yourself. At that point of time or at that point of day, you're going to be meeting them. Uh, with the Page of Cups, you're really not seeing this person as you have your wifey. Let me tell you one thing that maybe this person is going to offer you something. And they look like... Um, like they are not so mature or they are not so much ready to give you commitment. Okay, you're going to be feeling that way. Um, this may be a family gathering and you are a shy type, okay? You are a shy type, my group number two, whoever watching this video. You're really running away from one place to another. Ah, ten of sword. You're really ending a chapter or you're really breaking up with somebody. Uh, I don't know, Ten of Swords, some old chapter is ending, you're cutting cords that is really no longer serve you anymore. Four of Pentacles and the Page of Wands. Look at that, two pages here. Definitely this person is going to be younger than you or you are going to be a lot younger than them. It's maybe your energy, okay? You're, someone in this group is very childish, very childish, very curious and very much powerful and action oriented. With the four of pentacles, okay, one is really working very good with the money, juggling between money, or really very much good in handling lots of money. Another one is very much stable, okay? So financially, very much stability is here. So when, how, where you're going to be meeting this person? Let me tell you, in a family gathering, um, the place where you really feel like it's a safe place for you to go, uh, maybe there will be your mom, dad or somewhere. Okay, you're really childlike energy. Okay, there is, it feels like you got somebody that is looking after you. Okay, it's maybe your uh, elder sibling. It's maybe your elder brother, <laughs> like elder sister, your mommy, daddy, your grandma, granddad is here. That is really looking after you. And, uh, and the time when you are really feeling like you are uh, cutting all the, all the cord. Cutting all the cord. Okay, you are not. You are not in a connection with your ex, okay? You're really cutting off the cord with somebody with the Ten of Swords. Look at that. And also, my darling, Two of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles, a place where it's really familiar because Four of Pentacles is really homely energy. Why do you feel like it's very homely energy or homely gathering? Um, because Four of Pentacles is like home place. You're, you're feeling very much comfortable um, and you're very much, very much childish. And you're also very much enjoying the enjoying the whole environment. It's like picnic spot. Okay, and ten of swords. You're really um, you're really like after breaking up with somebody. I don't know. And with the seven of swords and ten of swords, maybe your mood will be very bad that day, or maybe you really wanted to skip that party, and you really don't want it to go there, but but something happened and everyone really insisted on you and you have to come there and that party and at that party you're going to be meeting this person family gathering party that you really had to in, go there um because of some issue i don't know you're really feeling shitty 
ആ ബാഡ് ഡേയും ബട്ട് ഐ ഡോ നോ സംതിങ് ഹാപ്പൻസ് ആൻഡ് ബോത്ത് ഓഫ് യു ആർ കമ്മിങ് ടുഗെദർ മേ ബോത്ത് ഓഫ് യു വിൽ ബി വെരി മച്ച് ഫ്രണ്ട്ലി ടുവേർഡ്സ് ഇച്ച് അതർ വെരി 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 ഫ്രണ്ട്ലി ടുവേർഡ്സ് ഇച്ച് അതർ മേ ബി ഇറ്റ്സ് ലൈക്ക് ബെസ്റ്റ് ഫ്രണ്ട് വെരി മച്ച് യങ് എനർജി യു ആർ ഓൾസോ വെരി മച്ച് യങ് അറ്റ് ദ ടൈം യു ആർ ഗോ ബി മീറ്റിംഗ് ദിസ് പേഴ്സൺ ഓക്കെ ഇറ്റ്സ് നത്തിങ് അബൌട്ട് ഏജ് ഇറ്റ്സ് അബൌട്ട് മെൻറ്റൽ യു ആർ ഗോ ബി വെരി യങ് ഓക്കെ യു ആർ ഗോ ബി ഫീലിംഗ് ദറ്റ് യങ്നെസ് so let's go and see my darling but what your person's romantic fantasies will be okay your person's fantasies three guides my guardian angel archangel michael mahar so please tell me my group number 2's fantasies group number 2's future spouse's fantasies about my group number 2 okay you got the wheel that is the wheel of fortune you got the king of cups wow wow and you got the ace of pentacle your person is really cuddling okay they're really fantasizing about cuddling with you all night all night long with candlelight on and your person really want that comfortable energy with you okay your person is really someone that they really love hugging cuddling cozy nature like very much cozy cozy in bed warm hugs okay your person is really like that wow Also my darlings I can sense that your person's one of the fantasy is that you are really serving them food uh like in a very uh, beautiful outfit you are serving them food like you know that Japanese made outfit like it's Chinese made like you know that made uh, outfit that black and white uh, that frock that one piece I I hope you get my point you know that amazing like you know stockings uh if you're a female watching this video of course it's for you so you're really wearing a very beautiful outfit like victoria secret oh my god and you're serving them food and they are really patting you oh my god this is one of their fantasy and if you are a man watching this video your person really want you to dominate them okay it feels like you know if you're a male watching this video your female really want to serve you beautiful things by wearing very beautiful clothes okay very like revealing clothes okay like see through clothes they want to serve you something and uh, it's like you are enjoying their look okay so it's one of their fantasies and if you're a female watching this video let me tell you your person really want your naked body they really love to see your naked body all the time i don't know it's not like they are lusty it's like it's uh, satisfying them that they are so lucky to got you because it's your body it's your shape it's your aura so powerful that everybody really want you and nobody got you okay it's only them that they got you uh your person is really feeling that kind of a heroic energy uh by getting you as their happy or wifey okay because the will of fortune they feel like they're very much lucky to got you as their happy or wifey okay it feels like they are very much lucky ace of pentacles a new connection is coming towards you my group number 2 you don't know this person as well so what is really coming wow you got the eight of wands and two of wands so both of them are wand energy and eight of wands is all about very much playful very much sexual and also over the phone okay maybe your person really love to talk with you over the phone at night maybe late night talkings that they, they love it okay maybe they really love to do some sexting and we did two of ones one of your person's fantasy is like living a life like a gypsy with you like going one place to another and really traveling and roaming around the world and exploring new restaurants new hotels trying new foods and you know like uh dressing in a different style i know th- this is your person's fantasy but your person will really try to fulfill their fantasies as well with you eight of wands your person really love to uh spend some beautiful amazing time with you in the nature and both of you really love to seduce each other wow You know your person's one of you know if you're a female watching this video your male partner really you know their fantasy is that you are lying naked 
uh, and pouring lots of fruits on your body and uh, lots of alcohol on your body or maybe fruit juice or cream on your body and you are you are lying on the bed and you are really asking your person that hey come over me and eat me like something like that your person is really you know dreaming about this or your person really want to test you why do i feel like that your person really want to kiss you suck you bite you uh, want to test you they're going to be using their mouth a lot on you in the fantasies and in the real world also because it's about the fantasies so i don't know you know your person's uh one more fantasy is that you are wet in the rain or you are really getting wet in the rain and both of you are dancing in the rain this is also their fantasies like uh you are wearing that see through dresses and in the rain you're wet and it's oh my god <laughs> you're looking so freaking beautiful it's like you are a beautiful white rose you are that beautiful red rose and you are like wet so you can imagine right that beautiful fresh rose and that got some water on that petals and it looks so fresh so beautiful smell is coming out of that you are like that my group number 2 to your person okay your person really fantasize about you so romantically they are very romantic person because as you as you can see there is king of cups king of chalices So your person is going to be very romantic when it comes to their fantasies. You know, one of their fantasy is you are in a rose garden or in a flower garden, really naked, waiting for them to kiss you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Wow. I'm gonna be pulling one more card last. Okay, four of pentacles. That's really came to eyes. uh because from the tarot there was also four of pentacles your person really love to care about you and whenever you are like really sleeping it's one of their fantasies that you are sleeping and your person is watching you staring at you and loving the way you shape and checking your body that how beautiful you are how unique you are and how crazily 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 sexy you are Four of Cups and Three of Swords. Your person really wants you to block all of your excess and all of your, uh, m- you know, opposite genders friends. Okay, so if you are a female watching this video, your male partner really want to, really want you, uh, to block all of those males. And if you are a male watching this video, your female really want to block. all of those other female friends from your phone of course is your fantasy okay they really want to see that you are giving them lots of attention and other um friends that is in opposite gender they are getting jealous that you my pile number 2 you are giving lots of attention to your own person okay i don't know why your person feels like you are giving them a whole lot of attention and other people really want your attention and they don't get it Uh this is your person's um beautiful fantasy fan, you know fascination or fantasy. Okay? Maybe your person really didn't get lots of attention in their home when they were a child. So so that's why they really want all 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 attention from you. Where of course they really want to explore the world with you. It's also one of their fantasy that they want to explore the world with you they want to go for a new place you know every time you're going to be meeting them you feel like they always want to explore explore new places that is um that you and your person will be visiting for the first time okay so now we're going to be knowing that what your person is going through in the present moment while you're watching this video okay their present energy okay my group number 2 We're gonna be checking that. My spirit guides, my guardian angel, Archangel Michael, my higher self, channeled message to me for my group number two. That what is group number two? Future spouses, current energy, right? Okay. So the first card is the Panchamama. Panchamama is a card of Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, very much earthly energy. It all feels like your person is going right now. They are very much in love with the earth, with the nature. they love nature they love birds and animals they are animal lover also my darling right now i don't know why they are feeling a bit gloomy or they are feeling like 
they are not supported by their family by the other people um they wanted something more with their friends but their friends are very much jealous and envious of your person's success and your person is really knowing that i don't know your person is really getting lots of lessons right now while you are watching this video okay there are energies you know lots of things is happening around your future spouse that is making them feel that what real true human beings are and how this world really works so it's you know they're having a different kind of idea about the world okay so let's read the card punch mama card number 40 right okay so yeah what is there let's go read it punch mama represents the unconditional love that the earth has for all her children including the stones the plants the animals and humans she's the goddess of earth also known as gaia who pervades all creation in our planet thanks to punch mama our timeless soul can experience life in biological body the joy and pain we taste during our brief time on earth an invitation to discover the boundless love of punch mama you are a child of the earth now is the time to eat right love right and be joyous regardless of the circumstances you may find yourself in be grateful for your life your body and all that nourishes you punch mama invites you to release each breath embrace your joy and your pain equally and discover love through both let punch mama know how much you appreciate all our blessing with an act of service such as planting a tree helping save an endangered species or protecting the ocean my group number two right now your person is really protecting the earth so freaking much okay your person is protecting the earth your person is really uh, knowing lots of things about how to eat properly or how to take care of themselves properly because no one is going to take care of your person unless it is uh, himself or herself okay my darling your person is knowing lots of things about true nature um, and then they go, there you go with the lightning card lightning is really reminding me of the truth I don't know your person is going through spiritual awakening and they are going to lots of truth okay they are knowing lots of truth about how these things really work or uh, what is the true meaning behind all those intentions your person is really becoming very much strong and intuitive in themselves also my darling your person is knowing that how much powerful they are their own purpose their own career their own study their own well-being is very much important than anything else because i don't know maybe recently your person have been through lots of um experiences that your person think that no one is going to take care of your person only he or she can take care of themselves okay so my darling lightning is like lightning means truth lightning means something that looks scary but that is the ultimate truth okay card number 30 let's read some of the messages on the card number 30 right so here it is the force of the upper world are investing their gathered energies to ignite you with new inspiration and creativity allow this divine gift of lightning awakening to take root in your being and enjoy a renewed sense of clarity passion and vision the formidable electrical discharge of a lightning of a lightning bolt brightens the sky and strikes the earth accompanied by the mighty sound of thunder the phenomena has a positive aspect the light illuminates the earth and the psyche but there is a destructive side as well the bolt can burn and even kill if it's too strong so my darling it's it's your person that is really knowing that only a person can grow and be more creative day by day or can kill themselves only a person got true power to change themselves maybe a person is changing from root okay your person is really becoming a new person uh you change or it's a death card for me lighting it's death card for me the time master maybe a person right now is really knowing that time really matters something sometimes we really think that we we have got time we don't have to do 
anything in hurry or later everything will be fine no your person is knowing the true meaning of time time means something that is really eternal okay so your person is really knowing about the divine timing or about the perfect timing you know what is a perfect timing there is nothing called perfect timing when everything is done when magic is done this is the perfect timing okay when there is really you know a uh, scorching sun you are feeling very much hot and everything around you it's super hot and you feel like oh my god it's too hot i cannot even breathe and then the then the rain started right my darling and when the rain will start this is the perfect divine timing for you to understand everything has its own timing or like the season really change like there is day and night like everything is really changing as it should be okay like we are growing the plants are growing everything has its own time so may my darling your person is also really uh becoming a person that obey time maybe your person always run late okay whenever it's come to follow the routine your person cannot follow their own routine i don't know your person is maybe always running late when it when it comes to uh start a meeting or they're always late for school they're always late for class but right now your person is knowing that true meaning of time that they need to be in time and they are like they are like time master okay so let's go and read the guidance of the time master card number 57 right so time is a construct of the human mind through which life events are seen to flow in a straight line from past to future this however is an illusion time moves in patterns fractals sometimes turning like a wheel and other moving straight as an arrow humans see time like a ticking clock and this image remind us that there is only so much of it to spend in life like a kind of currency at any given moment you can see time in all its infinite potential at once vast and all encompassing then shrunken and finite it all depends on perspective when the time master visits you he asks a most important question will you break free from limited cause and effect thinking by moving beyond the linear illusion and welcoming the cyclic quality of time you find yourself in a moment when the wheel of time turns and you are able to influence the past thus changing the present and future simultaneously this is the true taste of time master you are being invited to take back your power and let go of the past and think about your present and do whatever take place to change your future my darling let me tell you one thing your person is really changing their future by turning their present time i'm getting my darling you know there there is a saying that history repeats itself yes my darling your person is not going to make that mistake so that their mistake can be again repeating right my darling so your person is really changing look at that the time master like infinity sign is also there right your person is changing into something more greater version of themselves they know the value of time right now okay so i don't know maybe they're changing their luck they're changing their destiny maybe they're really changing as a human being as a person your person is really changing their behavior their goal as well as whatever they wanted to become in the future your person is changing happy happy your person is becoming more happy person day by day because they know the true meaning of life that exactly what they want to be uh, in the future they know that if if they are happy in the present time they will be happy in the future and your person know that uh, the energy is getting momentum your person is really getting lots of positive thoughts um from the friends or from the professor or from the people that your person right now in touch with okay your person is really becoming more positive Maybe your person really there is like geographical distance between you two, but I can sense that your person is really becoming very positive about their future. It's time to release negativity, full moon in Scorpio again, my darling. Let me tell you, your person may be a Scorpio because I was getting the death card as well. So I am getting my group member 
two your person is really becoming more positive they are releasing their negative thoughts pessimistic thoughts because they know time is very much auspicious and they need to use the time in positive ways to become more positive in future right my darling so it's one card for you starfish open to infinite possibility yes my darling really your person is really someone they believe in infinite possibility they are really becoming that starfish spirit okay they're really trusting the time they're really becoming that star famous person okay they're really changing their luck as well because for me this star means starfish they're open to infinite possibility maybe in the past they were always limiting themselves limiting their luck limiting their ideas you know they're having some boundaries but they are breaking away from that and my group number two let me tell you one thing maybe you thought that something that is very much impossible to you and you don't know how to make your dream real my darlings you will see that whatever you thought whatever your wild dream is that is coming true maybe a beautiful dream that is coming true my group number two okay maybe this is your wild dream you thought this is this will never happen but this is happening to you wait and if you believe what an amazing card right my darling wait okay so wait for the time wait for the right time so you don't have to hurry okay you, you don't have to rush in a rush okay so don't get um super impatient if you believe yes this person is coming towards you my darling if you believe that yes this person is coming you don't have to worry about it because everything is in the perfect place as it should be okay so my darling this is all i got for you my group number two if you like this video give it a thumbs up also my darling subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon so that you can notified by youtube whenever i upload new videos also my darling comment down below which part is resonating with you and also my darling so i suggest any kind of topic i'll definitely do that till then stay blessed and happy i love you so much hello my darlings my amazing group number three so if you just this amazing show this is your reading and we are gonna be knowing that how you're gonna be meeting your person physically for the first time okay my darlings so we are gonna be knowing that speak guides my garden angel archangel michael my herself please share message to me that how when where you're gonna be meeting this person and then we are gonna be knowing from the other tarot decks that their romantic fantasy is about you okay my darling speak, speak guides my garden angel archangel michael my herself share message to me for my group number three and please tell me that when where or how my group number three will be meeting physically meeting their future spouse for the first time okay so first of all we we're going to be knowing these three cards and i will pull more cards wow eight of cups page of sword and five of wands right my darling so my i can sense that first of all you guys are going to be having lots of unconditional love for each other even from the first time uh there is love at first sight as well with the page of sword and five of wands you guys are gonna be meeting in a place where there is some kind of conflict going on uh maybe like some kind of debate going on <laughs> i don't know some argument is going on uh with the page of sword it's maybe a place where um you are just curious about you are just suddenly you are in that place and some people are really arguing and you are like what is going on there and then there you met this person okay i really want to know more because it's really super exciting to a sword maybe you got two options queen of cups uh wheel of fortune and you got the hero friend okay it's maybe legal matter it may be something that you really don't know okay and there is some argument going on or maybe that place that you're gonna be meeting that is going to be very magical and um it's predestined you don't know that okay because the wheel of fortune is suddenly you guys just met so it is the main thing that it's faded okay it's faded you have to meet this person in this way and surrounding okay maybe there there is a place maybe not in your family then you don't know them okay some random people are arguing about something that's that is also going to happen with the five of ones or maybe some teamwork is going on there and they are arguing about uh something and you already got two options okay and you're not sure and you're very much closed off you don't sure you're not sure that 
if you want this person or not. With the Queen of Cups and Page of Swords, this person from the first day, they're going to be showing you that love and affection. I don't know. It's going to love at first sight for your person, okay? From your person's perspective, your future spouse really fall in love for the first time for you. And directly, they're really going to be, you know, maybe you guys met for the first time. And this person will be really taking initiatives uh, in the conversation. They really started talking to you and knowing your, uh, like, name where do you live what do you do for a living or whatever okay you do then my darling suddenly okay maybe in five weeks or maybe in five months this person is really going to propose you for marriage i'm going to skip the dating phase and you're like um okay oh my god it's too good to be true really you want that yeah because it's wheel of fortune your luck is really turning into that high positive side that you are not expecting my group number three it is like an expected fortune that is coming towards you congratulations with the ace of cups my darling let me tell you maybe you're dreaming about this person or you are having lots of dreams about your future spouse just before meeting them in physical world you're gonna be connecting with them in the 5d world as well with the page of sword you're gonna be that younger version and you really don't know that why your person really like you so much because your person is really much sensitive and empathetic maybe your person can sense that you are the one from them something really whisper into their ears that this is the one i know it's purely magical but it's going to be your person side but your side it's really just you met this person in a very chaotic situation and you really really hate that situation but still by talking to them that makes you relieve that makes you feel lots of relaxed and you love the fact that they're very much loving and giving and you guys have a beautiful friendship and from the first day you really wish to have a person like them and this is the way you meet okay my darling it's it's very sweet it's very cute and let me tell you something it's very much magical for your person but it's very normal for you okay you're not gonna be feeling something weird but your person will feel something weird or something very much magical in this meeting but you will not feel that okay so now we are gonna be knowing that my group number three what is your person's fantasy okay my three guides my garden angel i can tell michael my heart self what is going on what is going on with your person's fantasy about you okay how your person really fantasizing about you eight of pentacles and six of wand okay i am getting that your person really love the fact that whenever you get angry your person is really making up your mind with a rose and making you some tea making you some coffee and really cooking for you and your person really want to make up your mind they really want to spank you whenever you are feeling low is a fantasy that you are really in a gloomy face and you're telling your person hey i'm not feeling well today and your person is really spanking you really giving you rose and kissing your butt and kissing your legs and really you know giving you some hyping words and you're feeling so happy i don't know your person really wants to become the confidence pill a confidence pill or confidence dose to you okay you are your person really want to be the happy pill to you okay my darling your person really want the reason uh, for your confidence this is their fantasy that you're gonna be admitting that I am so much happy because of my future spouse your person really want to hear that with the ten of wands and the knight of pentacles i am getting that your future spouse really someone that they are they're really going to give you lots of things okay they really want to give you food uh luxurious things jewelries to you and they really want to take some uh you know long drive with you they really have to go for a long drive and they really want to do uh, some surprising things for you like surprise date surprise birthday party surprise you in a day that you're not expecting them to meet okay in a dating phase you're gonna be enjoying but i know they are skipping their date but after marriage you guys will be dating a lot you guys are gonna be moving from one place to another a lot with the ten of wands your person really want to carry you and make love with you if you're watching for a female your person really um 
want to be in your arms a lot okay they are very clingy my group number three okay whoever you're watching this your person's fantasy is to get in touch with you you know like exactly like magnet and iron they want to cling on you okay i hope you're getting my point that they, they really i'm really going to i'm really getting some clingy energy from your person uh your person's fantasy is to always physically in touch with you they really always want you physical look at that the name of ones okay so your person is you know one of their fantasy is they want to dance with you in a party and everyone is really appreciating and applauding that how beautiful dancer you and your person is maybe your person really want to dance with you or uh, maybe you really done so well that your person really want to dance with you and want to make jealous other people who really don't get you okay um very much childish energy also i'm getting yeah again look at that in these two poses really dancing pose your person's one one of their fantasy is dancing with you also one of their fantasy is that whenever you are getting jealous uh you're just holding your person's hand or look at that in this two card eight of pentacles eight of cups uh whenever you are getting jealous your person is really making up your mind and you're not talking with them and then they are really giving you roses and dancing with you and kissing with you this is one of their fantasy okay wow it's cute uh yeah with the eight of sword triple eight my darling they're gonna be very 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 rich okay my group number three whoever you are watching this for man woman doesn't matter but the but your future spouse is going to be very rich very wealthy very much abundant okay extremely rich extremely abundant person is coming towards you with the eight of sword maybe whenever you are getting some illusion that your person is having an affair with somebody else and you are very much angry your person's fantasy is that they are making up your mind by giving you something and you are feeling so loved and happy also in the bottom of the deck i can see the eight of wands so my darling number eight is the number of saturn maybe you got a very strong saturn in your chart maybe you're going to some saturn transition or uh shari shati okay um going on you know that is a uh, seven and a half years of your saturn transition like saturn return you are really going through that or maybe between that time you're going to be meeting this person I don't know my darlings eight eight is the number of abundance money richness maturity and long term and commitment maybe after a long time you are really getting into a relationship and you are end up marrying this person okay maybe you really want to get married but due to some reason you really not finding the perfect person for yourself and you've got it okay maybe month of august is your birth month or your, your person's birth month and my darling in the month of august maybe you guys met with each other i don't know your person really want to do some crazy things with you um but your person's dream is that they are really chasing you and they are really making up your mind that's why from the first they will start chasing you they always maybe always maybe your person is the one that he or she is always chased by other person okay so that's why your person is really don't want to be the runner they want to chase somebody and make love and make marriage to them and, and making marriage to them and this is going to happen exactly in your case okay you got the four of pentacles and this freaking card came for the three pies maybe someone is watching the whole video four of pentacles is giving me the energy that my group number three i am getting that your person really love the fact that when you are sleeping your person is watching you watching your body and little details maybe your person really want to know each and everything about your body this is also one of their fantasy okay and the last card that is wheel of fortune your person feels very much lucky that you really marry them and they they got a chance to chase you and marry you wow darling they really want to be the chaser so please don't chase them let them chase you okay my darling i know it's weird but it's okay for your person uh what is your person's current energy when you are really watching this video okay what your person's current energy right now so what is it 
uh, you got the wild woman. So wild woman is really making me feel that your person is very much free spirited, independent. They don't want any kind of restrictions, rules, norms. They really don't want that. Right now your person is cutting all the cords and making sure that they are free and they are independent. No one is really tying them down or weighing down. Your person is cutting all the cords. They are becoming more wild. Maybe your person always wanted to be wild, but because of some situation, your person was not able to breathe freely that they always wanted because they are the wild child. They are very much creative. They are like wild horse. They want to run away in the woods. They want to run away in the desert, in the beach area, and they want to come back to you as your wild child. They're going to be very loyal towards you. And they are going to be very committed and a very much fighter. They are also very much creative. Right now they are going through lots of transition, lots of transformation. Maybe they are knowing themselves in a more better way. Maybe they push themselves so hard to the age that right now they are knowing that they can fly. Um, I want to know more about the wild, wild woman. Okay, number 62, right? Yeah. When the wild woman comes to dance in your reading, you're invited to shine brightly and to know that your true self is being called out to engage the world. This is a symbol that a long-held dream is beginning to take root and wants to express. Your authentic self doesn't fix in a box. It needs the freedom to shine. It's time to have courage and step into the light. The wild woman says, shine brightly, dance with abundance. Be yourself and let the great spirit decide what happens. You will be happy you did. Okay, so my darling, your person right now is really becoming more authentic, more honest. And they're really not faking their emotion anymore. Maybe in the past they did, but they're really not going to fake their emotion anymore. Then you got this stuff, my darling. They're very stubborn. They're very wild. They're very tall person coming towards you. Your person is going to be, right now, they are really very much stubborn. Once they want freedom, once they want independence, that's it. They want it. Your person really want independence. Your person really want to be strong, rooted, deep rooted. They want to stand by their side. And they don't want anybody by their side, okay? They really want to do it alone. It's all their full power, full potential that they are embracing. Your person is becoming more strong and strong and strong day by day. They are not going to be someone that they need some help from other people. He or she is becoming their own ruler. They're like bossy, bossy type. They're also very much stiff. And once they want something, they want it. They're becoming very much committed as well in the relationship maybe in the past your person was like you know having some commitment phobia they were not able to get in a commitment relationship i don't know because of their past uh, baggages because of their past negative things but right now they can do that because they are a wild woman they are really having that amazing creative energy to make themselves so vulnerable and make themselves so like that like the ocean like they flow they don't have any boundary, okay? They can go anywhere. They can do anything that they want, okay? Because they are living the fullest. They are alive. My group number three person is really not restricting themselves anymore. Wow. Why they are becoming so like... A, like your person is really becoming like a storm. Like it's enough, it's enough, okay? Enough is enough. Your person is really enough of... All the streets and regulations and forms. Oh my God. Really your person want to break through all the chains. And they want to be the free bird. And right now they are doing it. They really don't care what other people think about them anymore. Look at that. Jaguar. My darling, your person is becoming so powerful like a jaguar. Okay. They are like so powerful that they are like becoming the predator. Okay. Nobody can stand in front of them. And nobody can make them scared anymore because now they are the most scary and fearful animal ever. The jaguar is a protector of all life in the Amazon. And in times of fear, she brings courage and certainty. Jaguar is at the top of the food chain and never becomes prey. With great stealth, she can track her mark 
from a distance and not to be seen or heard. She moves gracefully through the jungle, relishing, and, uh, relishing the abundance of the rainforest, fearless and at ease. Jaguar knows the ways beyond death and is a master of the shadows, blending invisible between light and the dark, night and the day. Jaguar calls you to explore beyond the walls that confine you, to go outside your normal routine, to push your limits and boundaries. She is delivering an invitation from your own future to investigate the unknown, to venture into the mystery and dark places you have been re re reluctant to explore. Okay, my darling, I'm getting that. Group number three, your person is really becoming strong, fierceful, powerful enough that other people will never able to control over them. Your person is really becoming powerful that no one can manipulate them, no one can overpower them, no one can make them feel scared or anything because your person is the most fearful person ever because they are fierceful. Okay, not fearful, sorry. They are fearful and they are fearless. They are like devilish. They are like strong. They are like king. Okay, they are like the jaguar. Like jaguar telling you that, Hey, I am not scared of anything at all. Light and dark, that's besides me. I got everything. Okay, oh my god, my group number two person is so strong. You know, they can really shut the society off. Society cannot define who they were, who they are, or who they want to be. Your person really make trends, okay, my darling. Your person really do take lots of responsibility. Whatever happened to them, whatever will be happening to them, it's their full responsibility. They don't want to. They don't want other people, or they don't want other family member to take responsibility on behalf of them, okay. So, what is your relationship be like? No place like home. I am getting that you are going to be their home and they are going to be your home. You and your person, both of you are going to be living far away from your homeland. So, you're going to be missing your home a lot. Uh, maybe your person really find that home in you and you guys are going to be really spending a lot of time with each other. Okay, really not think, thinking about other people anymore. A win-win outcome is forecast. Believe in the impossible. What beautiful two cards is really here. My darling, let me tell you one thing. There is ultimately win-win outcome. Okay. Your person is a winner. Your person can see whatever they want. Your person can get whatever they want. They are the most powerful thing ever. And look at that. The win-win outcome is forecast. Full moon in Libra. So they got it. Whatever they wanted, they got it. And believe in the impossible. So my darling, something impossible is coming towards you. That is really that you are not believing um, <clears throat> from the start. But that is going to happen with you, my darling. Okay. What is there? Swan spirit time for a deep dive. This is the time is coming for you, my group number three. That you are going to be taking a deep dive. And you are very much happy that you take it. Okay. Because deep dives, one spirit is really telling you that spirituality is something that is going to give you more peace at this moment. Uh, you are manifesting this person, my darling. Maybe this person was not in your destiny. But it's going to feel like it, you are faded. Maybe, my darling, you are changing your destiny for your own good. Because of your good karma, you are making it, okay? Because you are a very powerful person. I want to know something from the swan spirit as well. Look at that. With their graceful long neck, swans are able to reach into the depths. When swan spirit arrives, you are called to take a deep dive beyond what is easily available on the surface. You may think you know what is best for you now, but take the plunge into the depth of your awareness, for there is knowledge you are not aware and great treasure to discover. Deeper understanding awaits you. And a perspective that comes from a greater self-knowledge is what you need right now to better understand a situation or relationship. As you come to know yourself more intimately, so you too will you come. So too will you come to better know others. So Swan Spirit asks you to go beyond the surface of what is happening between you and other and resist the temptation 
to judge by superficial appearance. No, there is much deeper potential for loving connections, forgiveness, and mutual understanding. Choose to de- choose to dive deep into your why. Asking the deeper question of yourself, you are led by the grace of one spirit. My group number three, let me tell you. Maybe you are thinking that that person is really good for me and I deserve them. My darling, you deserve more. Maybe the person that you are thinking, they don't deserve you. Maybe other person that is really having more good quality like you have, they deserve you. My group number three, take your time and time for a deep dive. Just you don't have to understand what other people are thinking about you anymore. Just understand yourself that who you are, what you need, and what you truly want. And just go with the flow. Because once we desire, go with the flow. Go with the flow. Whatever is coming, that is coming. You're going to be getting it, okay? Because angels knows better than you. God is having a more, far better plan than you have for yourself, no? Maybe you are thinking about a person that is really don't deserve you if you are really thinking about a person maybe you are thinking that maybe this is the one maybe this person really don't deserve you you deserve someone more better person they're coming towards you. if you're thinking about your ex your ex is not coming back if you're thinking pessimistic about yourself then worriness pessimism is not for you that's why the no card is here not the right time to meet your person that's why um you are not meeting them so why like maybe you're having question that why i'm not meeting this person why 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 maybe this is not the right time to meet this person uh compromise is going on some libra energy maybe you're gonna be having you're, you're gonna be doing some compromise with yourself of course like leaving your own country going somewhere else or doing something to change your life that will take some time right look for a sign there will be some sign before meeting this person maybe some synchronicities like anytime anywhere you can meet this person but not right now maybe the time will be very much soon very much like impossible like impossible we're gonna be meeting this person or maybe the person that you are thinking maybe this is your future spouse but this is not the right time to meet them you're gonna be meeting them in a perfect timing okay so if you're thinking too much or too much negative about a person don't think that because no card is really holding lots of uh, like answer like if you're thinking about your person that maybe this is my future spouse and and my other tarot reading i told you that yes this is the person maybe this is the person but this is not the right time to get married with them and the no card is also for you if you're really worrying about your love life if you're really thinking pessimistic about your love life if you're thinking that if i'm going to marry or not this worriness is not for you worriness is not for you okay and please my darling go and sleep because sleeping is very much needed for you First off, you are not resting well. Okay? So, my darling, this is all I got for you. My group number three, I hope you like this video. Give it a thumbs up also, my darling. Subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon so that you can notified by YouTube whenever I upload new videos. And comment down below which part is resonating with you. I also um going to do those suggestions reading, my darling. So, do suggest me topic. I'll definitely do that. Till then, stay blessed and happy. I love you guys so, so, so much. Mwah, 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 mwah.